Now we're talking about people who had misdemeanors or H and I felonies. We're not talking about sex offenders. We're not talking about sex offenses. We're not talking about drunken driving. We're talking about misdemeanors and H and I felonies. We want to get families back together. We want to have people able to get decent jobs. And so that's why we are very much working on this. It's right for the individual to have the second chance, and it's right for our job shortage. I'm focusing on, on jobs, too. We have a significant job shortage in Wisconsin. We have, for the last 11 months, 3% or lower of unemployment. Our employers are begging us to give them workers who have the right attitudes, who want to get back to work. And so we want to give those offenders who have records the ability to have that second chance and get back to work. There are 41 of the 50 states in America that offer some form of expungement or criminal conviction clearance. Uh, we are unique among the 41 in requiring that decision to be made and this is the magic uh, sentence, at the time of sentencing. So our bill takes that provision away. It allows a judge to make that decision at sentencing if uh, he or she desires, but it also allows the defendant to come back after they have completed the, their sentence and petition for expungement. There are five states of the 41 that offer expungement or clearance that have some form of age restriction, and Wisconsin is one of them. And under this legislation, we eliminate the age 25 restriction. We also apply those changes retroactively. We believe that it would be unfair that somebody 20 years ago under an incomplete law not have the same type of relief of defendants moving forward.